Our goal today is to make a painting of the persimmon, but we'll be using just the oil pastels. Starting with the frame. I have a circle one, but you can use a square one, it uh, won't change anything. I'm making a sketch with the lightest stick that I have. I could also take the light blue one, but as a persimmon is orange, I prefer to give it a warm undertone. Now that the general sketch is done, we can start blocking in the colors. Orange is our middle tone here, and I'm leaving some spaces for the glare, which will be yellow and white colors. Also mapping up the darkest shadows in the leaves and at the bottom, but leaving some of the lighter areas to show the reflected light. Now blocking in the background with the cobalt blue, some of it got on the persimmon, I'm removing it with a palette knife. Now let's map out the leaves colors. We are finished with our base layer and are starting on the details. We can also build up the darkness in the most shadowy areas. It is often advised to paint from dark to light, but as we are not painted but using oil pastels, we cannot do that. It is not opaque enough to apply light colors on top of the dark ones, so we are going from light to dark. Let's blend our colors to get rid of the lines and the white texture. To get a more painterly look, making the shadows more pronounced under the leaves, applying soft yellow pastel to the stem where the light hits it. Doing a lot of blending with different colors. I'm getting my softer oil pastel set to get a paint-like texture. You can skip this step and do a lot of blending instead to get rid of the white spots. Here you see me removing some brown from the area of reflection. Going over the whole persimmon with the palette knife and the soft pastel of appropriate color. Now we need to do a lot of blending with the palette knife, with the pastel stick. Introduce some color and then blend, blend, blend. Blending with white gives a softer look. Adding more details and nuanced color to finish up everything. I'm using the paper tissue to blend the soft pastel, it gives the most soft look. At the later stages we are applying the darkest dark and returning some of the lost glares with white color. Marking the date and let's look at our result. It looks kind of like an oil painting and we accomplished this with the drawing tools. Please check out this other video and the freebie link in the description.